Hey everybody, I'm Dr. Stephen Wadsock, trumpet professor and brass area coordinator here at Kennesaw State University. Today, I'm going to be performing for you the all district and all state etudes, as well as providing a few tips to help you in your preparation along the way. I hope you enjoy them. If you're a brass player who's working on these etudes, I'd like to personally invite you to our Kennesaw State University all state brass boot camp on Saturday, November 9th. Throughout the day, we will have master classes and sessions for each of the all state levels, including middle school, concert band, and symphonic band. For more details on the event, feel free to check out the link in the video description below. Both of these etudes come from the Jean-Baptiste Arbonne's method for cornet and trumpet, but if you are familiar with those versions, note that these GMEA versions have some slight differences. The lyrical etude, known as Tis the Last Rose of Summer in the Arbon book, is a lovely tune in a trumpet-friendly key. One challenge will be making sure our rhythm is lined up perfectly within the various subdivisions in this etude. In a span of only a few measures, we have eighth notes, triplets, dotted eight sixteenths, thirty-second notes, and sixteenth note triplets. I would recommend working on these rhythms slowly without the trumpet so that we can make sure they are perfect and we don't practice any bad habits. Also, work diligently to bring out the accented notes within this etude to help make the music really come alive. <laughs> The technical etude is deceivingly challenging, but with proper preparation, you'll be playing it in no time. My recommendation would be to learn each of the prevailing rhythmic patterns that repeat frequently throughout this etude, measures 1 and 4 specifically. Once these are learned, work on adding the appropriate pitches and fingerings in each subsequent measure. Pay special attention to the tricky modulation that starts abruptly in measure 15. Work to sing each measure clearly and on pitch before attempting to play it. Once you do start playing this on your instrument, I'd recommend playing the eighth notes with a long and connected style. This will help in avoiding issues with our air and fluidity of line when we start to increase the tempo later. I hope you found this video helpful in your audition preparation. Don't forget to check out the links in the video description below where you can find out more information about our All-State Brass Boot Camp as well as the Trumpet Studio here at Kennesaw State University. Thanks so much and go Owls!